This will be for the feminine Sagittarius energy. We're going to try to see what's going on for the month of June for you. I don't really care what's between your legs. I've said it before. I'll say it again. There's feminine energy and there's masculine energy. So if you are a feminine Sag, I'm glad you're here. And let's see if the cards have any information or insight for us for this month of June. Let's tune in. Tune into the Sag feminine energy, please. Feminine Sag energy. What do they need to know? Okay, Sag, truth. This is all about truth for, for you this month. Um, you might be feeling closed off, like you have to shield yourself. Um, feeling like you um, are not seeing what is right in front of you or choosing to not look at what you, you know you know you should be seeing. You might feel like you're playing chess with the people in your life, whether that's at work, home, um, relationships in general. Um, I see someone who wants to be open, but maybe I don't know if the gears inside are fully uh, working or they don't feel like they're fully working. Wanting to open one's heart, give one's heart. I don't know if this has to do with this truth here. There is a Knight of Pentacles, and this is the slowest moving knight. In this in this picture, he is not moving at all. Like, not at all. His uh, ride is just kind of like totally laying there. Anyway, um, yeah. Basically, they're offering a gift of love. They're moving towards you. So someone's moving towards you, but slow. Is it a Leo energy? I don't know. It could be someone that um, needs to uh, unshackle themselves, um, you know, get a grip on their, their beastly side, you know, tame their beast. We might be looking at what we don't have instead of what we do have. This might be advice to look at what we do have instead of what we don't have this month. And judgment. Um, this truth here, okay? Uh, and I see under it this nine. This nine of wands. All right, so we're, we're defensive about a truth. Either we're keeping or that we're finding out or we're feeling judged. Um, this judgment is heavy duty. There's something that, like, you know, wrecking these, wrecking this per this, these people's worlds here. It's uh, catastrophic, really. And... This could represent that it's time to let go, maybe, of some things, you know, that we've already been through, okay? And, um, accept what the truth is. Accept it, you know? Maybe, uh, see it so we can open our heart again. This could be an, en if this is not the energy that made you, you know, feel like you were questioning a truth and you know, holding on to a possible, like, uh, are they coming back, are they coming back? Because that's my wounded warrior standing there waiting, waiting. Um, you know, judgment's a new beginning. Something needs to end, a new beginning can begin, you know? And then we can give our heart, all right? Open our souls up again. Um, maybe... To me, this, I, I'm just feeling calculated, calculated. So I don't know if you feel like you have to be calculated in relationships. You know, maybe you're scared to open up, give your heart. If this is representing an energy coming towards you, it might also be a shielded uh, energy. You both look pretty shielded. Maybe you're both going to have trouble, you know, feeling like you can trust and open the cup, you know, offer the cup. But underneath that, we have the Nine of Cups, so this could be a good thing. And um, this month, I don't know, maybe don't be so closed off. There could be a uh, King of Wands and energy, you know, this Knight of Disc, you know. Or if this was the energy in the past that made you defensive, this is the one that's going to help you open up. Uh, this is a fiery energy. Or it's representing how you're going to feel when you open your heart again, okay? Because under that, too, look at that. Under this high priestess, it just keeps going. Uh, you have the magician, where everything is in front of them to manifest what they what they desire. Uh, Gemini energy and also, you know, a new beginning. Looking at things differently, right? Looking at things differently, passionately. 
uh, a new new eyes, new eyes. Even this uh, King of Wands, new eyes, right? All right, that's your reading for the month of June. Looks like it's going to be full of passion if we can let our guard down.